Chapter 3. Paleo-Approved Foods Foods you can eat. We'll cover this in a bit more detail later. First is butter, then eggs, fish and seafood, fruit, herbs and spices, meat, natural oils like avocado, coconut, and olive, nuts and seeds, and vegetables. Big paleo no-no foods, as in no, you can't eat these. Grains. Grains, 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 like barley, rye, and wheat. Among other things, they contain gluten. Avoiding grains means no bread or pasta. Sugars includes high fructose corn syrup. So no soft drinks, fruit drinks, ice cream, pastries, candy, etc. Sugars may promote weight gain, give you diabetes, energy crashes, and blood pressure issues, among other health issues. Legumes. This means no beans or lentils. Dairy. Stay away from all low-fat dairy products. If you don't have problems digesting dairy, it may be okay to consume some full-fat dairy products like raw whole milk and certain cheeses, but only in small amounts. Hydrogenated vegetable oils like canola, corn, cottonseed, soybean, sunflower, etc. These oils cause unhealthy levels of inflammation. And remember, the essential fatty acids mentioned above? One of the major problems today is our unbalanced intake of omega-6 fatty acids compared to omega-3. A major factor in this unbalanced intake is the high levels of omega-6 fatty acids in these oils. Margarine. Margarine was created as a healthy alternative to butter. As it turns out, butter is the much healthier option. Most margarine has high levels of deadly trans fats in them. Artificial sweeteners. Things like Asulfame potassium, aspartame, saccharin, and sucralose are to be avoided on the paleo diet. Obesity is an epidemic, and many, many health problems have been connected to obesity. Obesity has been linked to diets high in processed foods, high in processed carbohydrates, and excess sugar intake. The potential health problems include heart disease, type 2 diabetes, cancer, and stroke. Yes, many of you are looking at this list of what you can't eat and thinking you could never follow a paleo lifestyle. Well, take another look at the list of things that you can eat. How often do you see some of those things on a list of foods you can eat while on a so-called diet? Not to mention the fact that a paleo diet does not ask you to count calories. Yummy, paleo-approved foods. Remember that list of approved foods? We're talking hamburgers, steak pork, bison, lamb, duck, turkey, chicken, and more. Bacon, baby. The whole world is better with bacon. Grass-fed, if you can. After all, meat with a bunch of added chemicals sort of defeats the purpose of the paleo diet, don't you think? Seafood includes fish like salmon, trout, shrimp, a variety of shellfish, haddock, and even more. You can eat lots of vegetables, such as carrots, broccoli, kale, and tomato, as well as onions and peppers. Sweet potatoes, yams, and baked potatoes are on the approved paleo eating list. This includes turnips, too. Yes to eggs as well. Hard-boiled, soft-boiled, scrambled, an omelet. Just add some of those vegetables and even some of the meat list if that's what you enjoy. Approved nuts and seeds you can eat are almonds, walnuts, sunflower seeds, pumpkin seeds, hazelnuts, chai seeds, and macadamia nuts as well. A large variety of fruit can be eaten when you go paleo. On this list is all kinds of berries, strawberries, blueberries, blackberries, etc. Apples, oranges, mango, and pears. This also includes avocados, which is a fantastic source of vitamins, minerals, and healthy fats that your body needs. Oils are an important part of the paleo diet and include the aforementioned olive, coconut, and avocado. Finally, we have our herbs and spices. There is something here for everyone to flavor your food. Sea salt, garlic, turmeric, mint, basil, rosemary, and many others can be part of your everyday eating. You will find slightly different approved foods with the paleo diet or caveman diet. Some will tell you that it's okay to consume certain things in limited quantities. This includes red wine. Science says there are a variety of health benefits to red wine hot chocolate using dark chocolate, and certain teas like green tea that is packed with powerful antioxidants that have a lot of health benefits. Hardcore paleo enthusiasts will tell you to go organic as often as possible, to only eat grass-fed meat, and consume wild-caught sustainable fish. If you can do this, great, but if not, don't let that stop you.
Following the paleo diet will do wonders for you, even if you don't go hardcore organic all the way. Do what you can. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.